Hey, it's Joe Lines. In this video, we're going to cover some basics, just checking and unchecking of controls. So this one is pretty straightforward. It should be a short video, I hope. Um, so let's start off with this. Now, the one thing I'll say is this is a little bit different in what I've covered um, previously. So control, we actually start off instead of like get control, set control. It's just control. And then there's a big group of settings. Let, let me just to demonstrate. Um, I'll bring over a screen clipping of it here. So these are subcommands under control. You can check, uncheck, enable, disable. I'm going to walk through some, not all of these, but just the formats are just slightly different. Uh, they're still, you're dealing with controls. We still use the class NN or slash control here, um, but you, you structure it. So first we say control, and then it's what you want to do. Well, I want to check something, um, and the value, this is going to be blank. This is one of those things, it's, it, um, you just have to know the control. Let's say, let's go ahead and get uh, this match case thing here. That's button two. So it's going to be button two. Um, and then, of course, the title. We'll do HK class. And um, I'm going to copy and paste because I hate typing. All right. So I'm going to check that button. Bam, look at that, checked it. Um, if I want to uncheck it, I'm just going to come down here and say uncheck. Save, reload, da ding. So, you know, if we wanted to be a little crazy here, we could do this sleep 250, sleep 250. I should have started at the top, but I'm going to put this in here and we'll say loop. Oops, there we go. Save, reload, and run. There we go, it's flashing, yay. Um, but that's how easy it is to connect to check them. Now, that's for a, a checkbox, but what if, you know, I'll leave that loop structure. We'll just, uh, actually should be fine without with it, just like that. Um, let's turn that off, that off. Uh, we don't care about the sleeps. Um, but instead, we're going to check this button this radio button right so it's button four um so we're gonna reload and run and there i checked it now um you can't uncheck well i'm sure there are some radio buttons you can uncheck or i shouldn't say sure i, I will bet you money but um what you need to do because this is a toggle right one of these some radio buttons will start off where nothing's selected and you can actually kind of get rid of it but this one one or the other has to be selected so what you do is you would just figure out the next one and that's button five. And so you would just turn on button five. So check button five instead of button four, right? Um, and and so if we wanted to toggle with the little loopy here, we can say button five and this one we're gonna make, oops, I should have said check and button four and loop, we'll turn it back on, save and reload. And now it's switching back and forth, right? So it's super easy way to, to check which items. Um, and that's, uh, that's that. Cheers.